good morning everyone welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome to a little vlog i am doing a few fun things this week so i thought i would vlog them today is tuesday and it's nice and early it is i think about 20 past eight and i'm gonna leave the house in around 10 minutes and my mum and i are heading to battersea power station which is a fun thing to do we've never been before and we were planning on going anyway it's my hair stuck to my face yeah we were planning on going anyway and then they reached out to me and actually invited me to go have a look around have lunch there and they kind of gave me a few vouchers as well for some stores so we are going to go and spend the day there have lunch i think we might do the lift what's it called the lift thing where you go right to the top and apparently it's a beautiful view so we might do that as well before we leave but i thought i would show you my outfit as i am ready on time i got up quite early this morning i got up at half six because i wanted to take maple out on a nice long walk before we left this is my outfit i'm wearing this gray blazer from source unknown i got it a while ago so i don't think it's still available i absolutely love it it's such a nice fit great quality i love their pieces because they are just so different to anything else like on the high street so i've got this on i've got hair bands on the sleeves as well to keep the sleeves ruched up because otherwise it's quite an oversized fit a little bit too oversized i think then underneath i've just got on this plain black vest from zara and black slip skirt from topshop and then I've also got my Adidas Sambas on for comfort. I thought that the grey as well worked quite nicely with the grey blazer. Obviously YSL Sac Du Jour. And I've got my new Bottega Dupe Amazon earrings on which I am obsessed with. I feel, feel like they make such a difference to my outfit. I don't normally wear like big earrings or anything. I just stick to tiny little huggies. But I feel like these just... I don't know, I feel like they change an outfit. This is my look, something quite comfy. As we're going early this morning, it's a little bit chilly out and the sun's not really come out, but it is supposed to warm up later this afternoon. So I thought I'd play it kind of nice and safe with something that is quite warm now with a jacket, but obviously I could take the jacket off. So yeah, we're in for a fun day of shopping. So I'll take you guys with me and obviously show you if I pick anything up. I'm back from Battersea. Something on my lens, there we go. Um, yeah, we're back from Battersea. I had a lovely day or morning. It was more of a morning than a whole day. And I picked up some gorgeous bits. I thought I would show you guys them and I'm home properly. So the first thing I got from Reformation, and I've never been to a Reformation store before. I've shopped online there, but I've never been to an actual store. And it was really cute. They had an amazing feature in the store and in the dressing rooms where they have these big screens or little ipads in the dressing rooms and you can look through everything that they've got out the back and just select different sizes and they bring it to you in the fitting room rather than having everything out on the shop floor but i picked up this skirt because i thought it'd be a great piece for autumn winter it's just a denim like mid axi skirt and it's got a slit at the back which I thought was quite nice. I just really liked this kind of washed out colour denim. I got it in a size 24, which I'm not sure what the equivalent is in UK sizes, but it fits probably like a size six, I would imagine would fit me. It was quite pricey, it was £188. It seems like it's really good quality. And that's what I loved about Battersea is they had a real mix of affordable high street brands and more high-end, more luxury brands. Speaking of the high street brands, had to pop into Zara, of course. And I was after something that 
was a bit more autumn winter appropriate i wanted to buy pieces that i knew i was going to get a lot of wear out of but i just didn't see anything that i loved for autumn winter so i ended up picking up something for the summer so i've got this little two piece these are the shorts really cute little like elasticated waist almost like pajama style shorts and then the matching shirt and i thought this would be a really nice two piece for during the day on holiday obviously i'll just wear the shirt open with bikini underneath i got them both in a size small shirt was 35.99 and bottoms were 29.99 so a very cute little set i did try on some like western style cowboy boots actually in zara but uh, they were a little bit too big for me, the size 5, which is my normal size, and the size smaller, the 4, was a little bit too tight. That was annoying, but I did like them, I just wasn't sure how much wear I would get out of them. So that is something for me to think about for autumn winter. And then I have a lovely bag of pieces from Theory, which is a brand that I've never shopped at before, but oh my goodness, I had such fun in there today, trying on pieces and looking at everything. There's some such gorgeous items in there. So the first thing I picked up was this beautiful little cashmere short sleeve fitted top. It's in this really nice off-white cream colour. And I just thought this is a perfect basic for autumn winter. So, so gorgeous. It's really soft. The quality is just insane. I got this in a size small. And then I love how they put the other bits in this like suit bag. So good for traveling this is really handy for me to keep actually really good for when i do like shoot days and stuff as well everything is still on the hanger perfect also the staff in theory were amazingly helpful i mean to be honest my mum and i were saying when we were sat down for lunch eating everybody that we met today was so helpful and so nice and everybody was just super friendly but the girl um in theory that helped me was particularly helpful so i also picked up these beautiful cream like drawstring trousers really really nice i've got these in the size small and they just fit really nicely really gorgeous quality again and i thought although these are like a light color and i could wear them now because they're so thick they would look great with some light colored knitwear and trousers as the weather gets a bit cooler but i do love to wear like bright neutrals my lighter colors in my wardrobe in autumn winter as well and then finally i also picked up this beautiful jacket from theory such a gorgeous like gray cream print beautiful silver buttons i just thought this was stunning absolutely gorgeous again amazing quality i got this in a size eight and actually all three pieces look so nicely together but I can definitely mix and match them with other things that I have in my wardrobe as well but I just could not leave the store without this jacket that was stunning. So that is everything that I picked up today so I think I'll end this part of the vlog here. I've got another fun day planned this week. Uh, my mum and I are going to Restoration Hardware so I think I'll probably pick you back up then unless I do something fun in the meantime. Good morning everyone. So I have got up nice and early this morning. I've walked Maple as I think you will have just seen and I am just about to leave to get my train into London. I've got a little event this morning, a brunch event, so I'm going to that as with Katie Loxton. You guys probably know Katie Loxton. They have amazing um travel cases and bags and handbags all that sort of stuff so yes i'm going to a little casual brunch with them and i thought i would show you guys my outfit before i leave so i am actually wearing the theory jacket that i got the other day at battersea because i just thought it was so nice really nice and smart and i wanted to wear it today so i've got that on just a plain white tee underneath because i think it's going to warm up quite a lot later um white trousers these ones are from source unknown but they are super old so i can't link them i have got my luevo belt on which is obviously in the gold hardware but this jacket is in the silver so slightly annoying because my bag's silver as well so it would have been better if i had a silver belt but i don't i then got on these like little flip-flop heels from zara which i'm not sure if i'm gonna wear 
or not. I just worry that they might be a bit uncomfortable, but I haven't got that much walking to do today and I just think they look really nice, like the full look, but I'm not sure. I may actually just quickly change into flat sandals instead. But yeah, this is my outfit. I will leave it linked in the description box for you guys and I'm off to London. now Wednesday morning I have got clothes on I'm not naked um, but we are heading off to Restoration Hardware which is really exciting I'm going with my mum we've wanted to go for a while well ever since it opened here in the UK so we are taking a trip there today it's not too far for us I think it's only going to take about 40 minutes to get there and the sun is shining it's a lovely day so Sorry, it's so distracting not being able to see the top of my dress. Yeah, so hopefully we'll have a lovely day. Probably get some nice pictures, have a look around, maybe have lunch as well. So I'm really looking forward to it. Like I said, it is a lovely day. It's really sunny. Got this dress on from Zara, which I actually never got a chance to wear on holiday. I bought it for my holiday and I never got a chance to wear it. But it's this beautiful like strapless seersucker top. And then it's got a nice floaty skirt. I've just got my brown Loewe basket bag and my brown Orans on. I actually really hurt my feet yesterday um, wearing the black ones of these because I haven't broken them in yet properly. So I've got plasters on, <laughs> but hopefully they're not too noticeable. Also wanted to wear this bag today because I don't feel like I've worn it enough this summer. I got it at the beginning of summer and I obviously swapped my classic Loewe basket bag. I sold that and I bought this one instead. And I do absolutely love it. I just feel like I haven't reached for it as much as I did the other one. And I'm not sure why. I don't know if that's because I've been wearing a lot of black. Obviously I bought the black Shaipri sandals and the black Oran. So maybe I just haven't been wearing these ones as much. So it means I haven't been reaching for a tan bag. I don't know. Um, we also obviously bought the little Marnie bag as well, so I've been using that quite a lot. But I thought that I would get it out today because it goes quite nicely with this dress. But I think it's a little bit too cold to just wear this. Well, it's not cold, but I feel like I need maybe a little light jacket or something. So as you can see, I've just slung this cardigan on the bed behind me. So I'm going to try that on or I might try a jumper over my shoulders, but... I'll try them both on now and you guys can tell me what you think. So this looks quite cute actually. I've just put this over my shoulders. It definitely looks better over the shoulders than it does on properly. So I could wear this, I suppose, or I might grab my stripe jumper and see what that looks like over my shoulders. Should I go for something like this? I mean, I've got to decide on my own. You guys can't help me because this would have been and gone by the time the vlog goes up obviously i don't know i really don't know i feel like i like the cardigan better but is it too much i mean we're only going to look around and go for lunch maybe it's a bit too fancy whereas i feel like this makes it a little bit more casual hmm don't know what to do
So we're just on our way home from Restoration Hardware. It was amazing actually, really, really nice experience. I'm so glad that we went. The staff were so friendly. There was valet parking, they gave us like a map, they talked us through everything. The food was really good as well. We ate at, I don't know how you pronounce it. Um, what did he say, Logia? Yeah, something like he that. He said to mum, did you eat at Logia? And she went, no. <laughs> we had pizzas and a glass of wine, but it was really nice. I definitely recommend going if you are close because uh, it's just such a nice day out and then they have the orangery as well which you can eat at if the weather isn't as nice but the weather was perfect today so yeah it was a lovely day out but I am going to end this vlog here so I hope you have enjoyed it if you did then please give it a like and if you're new to my channel it would be amazing if you could subscribe and I'll see you all very soon with another video